Breaking now, we are seeing some damage in Maysville, Kentucky right now. Sarah Selly is live there this morning where a lot of flooding damage can be seen with a lot of vehicles. Good morning to you. Good morning. OK, we're getting a good idea of some of the very devastating flooding that happened in Maysville and Mason County overnight. And I've got to show you this. This is a great example of what residents are waking up to. This is a creek and it is completely swelled. But on top of that, look at what you're seeing here. These are cars that were washed down this creek as a result of the flooding. They came from some of the auto lots that are just up uh, up away from this creek. They were moved by the floodwaters and then down this creek bed and came to a rest here where this pipe is. It looks like the pipe is pretty much what stopped these cars from floating down the creek further. Tons of damage. As you can see, several of the creek bed sides, the trees and some of the brush that's around the creek has been washed away. OK, we're going to move over here. I want you to see even further what some of the damage to the creek bed was. There's another car right there. At least four cars in this area were washed down this creek bed. They came from up that way and started flowing down the creek bed. As you can see as well, these were some of the trees and some of the, the brush that lines the creek bed. It is now off of its uh, normal location and was pushed there as part of the floodwaters. People in this area are completely stunned by what happened. Uh, they're in disbelief at this point. They can't really imagine this. Um, they said that the water came up over this bridge. It was that big at one point, and that's part of why this bridge has some debris and some washed out area. And even in this area, the damage is this bad. Right there, further on down, somebody went into the the uh, kind of the wood area right there and found a jet ski that was washed up into into the area next to the creek bed. Also, there's a pop machine down that way that was also washed as part of the damage. This is one of many examples of what's happening in Mason County right now. Folks waking up, trying to figure out how to clean up with all of this. We've got reports of houses that are off their foundations. We've got reports of people who have five or six feet of water in their homes. People who can't believe what they've been having to deal with. The flash flooding started overnight as a result of a pretty severe rainstorm. There are several creeks in this area, and many of those creeks swelled and jumped their banks and caused all this damage. Even over here to this abandoned warehouse, it's a tobacco warehouse that's not been in use for quite a while. But this uh, flood that was created as a result of the flash flooding caused a lot of damage to what's left of this warehouse. People are in complete disbelief this morning. We're going to stay on top of this for you and bring you the very latest here from Maysville, Kentucky. I can let you know that Mason County has been declared a local state of emergency by the judge executive in Mason County. And the mayor of Maysville is saying some of the worst flooding he's seen in many, many years. Luckily, nobody was killed as a result of this, but people do have a lot of property damage and they're just now figuring it all out. Back to you. Crazy.